Greetings viewers, welcome back to the channel. In today's video we have another tool video, another tool from Japan from Koken. This is the Wobble Fix Extensions in quarter inch drive. We're going to take a look at them and compare and contrast them to Snap-on's Wobble Plus Extensions. So let's go ahead and get into it. All right guys, so here it is in all its beautiful glory straight in from Japan. This is the Koken part number PK2763-6. The six piece quarter inch drive wobble fix extension set. Now, wobble fix, you might be wondering what is wobble fix if you're familiar with Snap On and Snap On's Wobble Plus extensions. Uh, a wobble extension is one where the end is made for the socket to move around slight degree, normally 10 to 15 degrees on the end of the extension so you can clear obstructions, things that are slightly in the way that you couldn't get onto with a straight on extension on a socket. Uh, the Wobble Fix or Wobble Plus from Snap-on is an evolution of the Wobble extensions and a standard extension. Uh, so with Wobble Fix from Koken, we'll grab a quarter inch Koken socket and just grab one of the extensions. So you grab it, put it on to the first click of the detent ball and you have 15 degrees of rotation angle here where you can get on a nut or bolt that is obstructed where you can't get straight on it you've got that slight degree 15 degrees of angle to turn and miss something that would be in your way up here now that's all well and good but sometimes you just want a nice straight on extension say you're trying to get something at a slight angle and you need to get it straight on but your socket keeps flopping because of the wobble so if you push to the second click, now your socket is fixed onto the extension like it's a regular extension. You've not got any wobble in it, and it just does what a normal socket on extension does. So you get the best of both worlds. You have regular extensions when you need regular straight on extensions, or you can pull back one click and you can get 15 degrees of movement to get around an obstruction. Really neat little invention. Uh, the cool thing about the Koken sockets, there's several actually, uh, of course being a Koken tool, it's made in Japan, so it's got that Japanese craftsmanship and quality that we've come to know, or at least you viewers have, that have experienced Koken tools for yourself, or what you have seen in my reviews since I've been using Koken tools for now over, uh, let's say, I think a year and six months at this point. Uh, so one really other nice feature about the Koken wobble extensions, actually all the Koken extensions, is the knurling. Koken gets some really deep, really aggressive knurling. Gives you great grip on the extension when you have greasy, oily fingers. Lots and lots of traction back here. Another cool thing is the way that they actually designed this knurl pattern is that, you know, when you put your extension down on something flat, it wants to roll away normally, but with the way that they design the knurling pattern on the Koken extensions, it acts like a flat bottom. So if it starts rolling, it will find us flat and stop itself, or a normal extension will just roll away as long as it's got an incline and some momentum built up. Not with the Koken. So really cool technology there. It's not going to roll away. It's got super nice deep knurling for good grip. You got the wobble when you need 15 degrees of movement, and you've got a straight on extension when you need a straight on extension. Really, really great. Uh, like we said, Snap On has something very similar called uh, Wobble Plus. Uh, we will take a look soon at the differences between the Snap On and the Koken extensions. So here's the little placard that comes on the back. We talked about the 15 degrees of wobble and the fix for straight on. We talked about the deep knurling and also the fact that the knurling provides a stable base where the extension won't roll away on you. We've talked about how the knurling, this is more about the knurling and stuff. Uh, and then you've got your six sizes breakdown. So you get a 28 mil, a 50 mil, a 100 mil, a 150 mil, a 200 and 250 mil extension. So you've got lots of different sizes, lots of combinations to make basically whatever you need work and whatever you, you need to get it to fit, uh, lip, short, tall, whatever, you know, you basically can do it with this six piece set. That said, let's go ahead and compare the Koken to the competitor product, the Snap-on Wobble Plus. Compare their extensions on their sockets and Koken's extensions to Koken sockets. 
All right, so Coke in Japan versus Snap-on USA. This is the Snap-on 106 ATM XWP, the Wobble Plus extension set. Six-piece set as well, uh, but slight variance in the length of the extensions in the Snap-on set compared to the Koken set. Well, first off, the Koken set, being Japanese, uh, is going to be in millimeters. The Snap-on set, you pretty much get the same size as equivalent, uh, but you do have a little bit longer long in the Snap-on. So you get a one and a quarter inch, you get a two inch, a four inch, a six inch, and an eight inch, and an 11 inch in the Snap-on setup, or the Snap-on set. So again, we'll grab a uh, comparable size Snap-on, Wobble Plus extension and a quarter inch drive, 12 millimeter snap-on socket uh, for a fair comparison. So again, you get that wobble on the first click and when you push to the second click, you get it straight on there. And uh, you know, they pretty much function the same. Uh, but here's where the snap-on comes up a little short. So we don't have that nice deep knurling on the back end where you'd want to start uh, an extension or turning a fastener uh, without a driver ratchet on the end, but you do have your knurling here. It's not as deep, it's not as grippy as the Koken. Really smooth, round edge here. You don't have that flat-spotted knurled technology like Koken does to keep your extension from rolling around and rolling away from you. So real quick, we'll push this off to the side. And uh, with the snap-on extension, once it rolls, uh, it keeps rolling until it hits something. And bye-bye uh, snap-on extension, still rolling. And if it wasn't for the lip on the stainless top, it would have gone off the edge of the toolbox. So let's grab the Koken, the same size. The knurling and the flat spots create friction and bring the extension to a stop. It gets that inertia knocked out of it where it won't keep rolling and roll off of whatever surface you're working on. Again, the snap-on. Bye-bye, snap-on. Once it starts rolling, it's gonna keep rolling until something stops it, until something touches it, hits it, you know, keeps it from rolling. Uh, so humongous advantage to the Koken. Uh, one, in overall quality, just looking at the machining, the Koken is much more precisely machined than the tips on the Wobble uh, plus snap-ons. Uh, they're not extremely consistent across the entire set, where the Kokens are very, very closely machined tolerances across the whole set. Koken wins with the big, deep knurling and the flat spotting on the end here, where you want to turn your extension. Snap-on loses by having smoothness here and not very deep knurling here. Choke up on it where you naturally want to turn it back here. At least, that's where I naturally want to turn an extension without a drive. It's on the very end. I don't want to choke up on it up here. Uh, so let's get the macro lens out and take a look at these up close. I'm gonna go ahead and swap out and grab a 10 mil Koken and 10 mil snap-on quarter shallow. So first up, we have the Koken. Looking at the precision machining on the wobble fix in, nice sharp lines, nice machining. You know, everything as it should be, symmetrical all the way across, all four sides. Very, very nice. Here's your part number, Koken 2763-150. We got the 150 mil. Now you see that nice deep knurling, super grippy, really, really nice. You also see how it creates flat spots to stop your extension from rolling away on you. So let's go ahead and put this on a shallow 10 mil Z-series socket. Here's our first click. As you can see, we've got our wobble going on here. And click it in to stop it. Super tight, barely any movement or wiggle in it, and uh, comes up flush. Really, really great fitment and quality from Koken Tools Japan. Now let's look at the Snap-on in comparison. So this is the Snap-on Wobble Plus. As you see, the wobble end, the machining isn't quite as smooth 
uh, but not so much on this extension as I can't remember which one it is, but there is a little bit of, you know, not as precise machining, a little boogered up looking. So snap on part number is back here. This is a TMX. This is a T TMX WP5 or six, six inch USA snap on. There's our knurling. Again, like I said, it's not as deep. It's not as grippy as the Koken. And uh, it's not here where you'd naturally want to grab the extension to turn it. It's uh, further up, which I'm not super much a fan of after, you know, handling the Koken. So snap on 10 mil quarter inch drive shallow socket. First, the retention is kind of weak. Uh, put it on there. You see we got our wobble going. Push it on up there. And uh, fits pretty well. Goes all the way down, locks on there with minimal wiggle again, just like the Koken. Uh, one issue I saw on the deep well quarter inch snap on sockets, it wasn't going all the way down and was staying loose uh, in the clicked on second position. Let me go grab a socket, see if I can duplicate that on camera for you. All right, yeah, so here is a snap on 12 deep quarter inch. And as you see, there's a gap here. Uh, the deep wells will not go all the way on for some reason, and you do have quite a bit of slop there when in the second position. Now when we compare that to a Koken, Koken 12 quarter inch deep well, when we click it on, again it clicks in fully seated and no movement. Uh, the Koken's fit and finish is a lot nicer than the snap-on, uh, especially with the deep well quarter inch sockets. All right, guys, and that'll do it for today's video talking about these gorgeous Koken Japan made wobble fix extensions available in quarter inch drive and three eighths inch drive, possibly half, but don't hold me to that. I know quarter and three eighths definitely. If you would like to purchase these or any other Koken tools you see me talk about on YouTube, Instagram, or TikTok, check out right here this link in the description or on screen, palmec.net. Palmec.net carries all of your Koken tool needs. Promo code on the screen now, Mr. Subaru 5, good for 5% off all Koken tools from Palmec.net. So if you want to get yourself a set of Wobble Fix extensions or anything else, check out Palmec.net, Mr. Subaru 5 for 5% off your order. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one.